Welcome to Cosmo Tutorial. I'm Nan, and thanks so much for stopping by. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a text link in WordPress. It's so easy, it's so simple. Um, the reason why I wanted to show you this video is um, it's, it's really important to have text link in your post. And one of the reasons, two main reasons, um, to increase your link popularity, and of course to increase your page ranking, especially in Google's or in the search engine. Now what you see here, you see two separate keywords, the Cosmo, I'm sorry, the Corporate Cosmo keyword, and the other one is RSS feed. If you notice it's bold, but there's nothing linked to it. So what if I want my readers to link to additional information about RSS feed? Okay, then I want to have a link right there. Okay, so you ready? Oh, it's going to be so simple. Okay, click on the back key. I'm going to, well, I'm going to click on the back. And this is my um, dashboard for WordPress. So, of course, I have my title already set. I have my post is in a totally different language. I don't know what it is. I don't really care <laughs> because right now this is just a tutorial. And here's my first keyword, Corporate Cosmo. Now, I want to link that text to my main website, which is the Corporate Cosmo. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight it. And it's bold right now, but it's the only reason why I bold it is for you to, um, it's easy for you to see the actual keywords while on the video. But it doesn't necessarily have to be bold. Okay, so I'm going to click on link, which is this little icon here. It looks like a, you know, a chain. And um, you click on that, and this is where you put in your settings and your link in this little box. Now, right in here is the link URL. Of course, what is the URL that um, that will link to that keyword or what that keyword will link to? And um, do this. This is a really simple one. I'm going to put in www.corporatecosmo.com, and that keyword... Of course, it's going to um, link to my Corporate Cosmo homepage. Now, your target right here, you have two options, the open link in the same window and open link in a new window. Now, me personally, when I have keywords in my post, I'd rather open link in a new window. And one of the reasons why is if your reader comes and open up your post and they click on your keywords, um, for additional information, you still want that first original site to be up and handy for them to go back to. If it's on the same window, that means they either have to hit the back key, and most of the times if you hit the back key, you're going to have some issues and problems. So like I said, let's make it easier for your readers and your visitors to navigate throughout your website. So I'm going to keep it on open link in a new page. And then, of course, you want a title. Now, in the beginning, when I was blogging, I paid, I did not pay attention at all to the title section. And then I realized, duh, you know, the title, um, this is what the search engine reads, the actual title, to see how relevant these links are on my post. So I'm going to call this title Social Media Marketing. And then I'm going to put uh, Business Blogging. And um, social networking. Oh, okay. Like I couldn't spell there. And then right in here is the class. And this is where the orientation on where you want to have your links. Is it the center, left, right, um, captions? I like to look, I like to see the little, you know, actual image captions of the of the, the actual link. And then I'm gonna click on insert. And you see how it, it it changed the color. It was black, and now it's purple, and it has the other line. That lets you know that that text has been linked. Okay? And I'm going to avoid some of these extra white space. There you go. Okay. Now, here's the second keyword, which is RSS feed. Now, I'm going to do this slightly different. I'm going uh, Go and click on the insert link, and I'm going to put in the link URL to a, let me see if I go copy that real quick. 
my bad, sorry. I didn't want you to see that. <laughs> okay, I'm going to link this to an article that I talk about, and the title is What the Heck is RSS Feed? RSS feed. So, once again, Target, I'm going to open it in a new window, and this title, I'm going to call it RSS Feed, and RSS Feed for Business Blocking. Um, you can call it whatever, but um, I'm going to have to have those titles on here, and I can do it. Uh, caption in here and hit insert. And once again, you see it is purple. And it's underlined to let you know that yes, that is a linked keyword. And um that is it. I'm going to update this post and then we're going to do a quick preview of the text link in our post. So I'm gonna click up here to visit the site. And um, voila, see, if I click, I don't want to use that one, but if I click on Corporate Cosmo, see how it gives you a preview of my homepage to my Corporate Cosmo. And then right up here, the RSS feed, yes, there go my article. Wow, <laughs> what the heck is an RSS feed? So your readers are going through here, they click on the actual link and it will bring you to the actual site that you linked that keyword to. See how easy that is? And I have it in a separate, um, an actual separate site, separate window, and I can always go back here. And then I can always say, well, let me go back into that website. And there you go. And that's it. I told you how easy that was. I mean, I told you we're going to do it with style. <laughs> so if you need to contact me or you need to email me, um, please email me at nanwasatcorporatecosmo.com and let me know what you think about the video. And if you have any additional questions or comments, um, please hit me up. Um, once again, um, thank you for visiting, and um, you have a wonderful, marvelous day. Thanks. Bye.